Jack Sizemore's RV Museum, they have the original first built Itasca motorhome. Uh, it was done in 1975 and this, it really is the original. It does have just under 6,000 miles on it, um, but it was used for more promotional purposes. So everything in here is uh, pretty much original. Winnebago Industries built this Itasca on a uh, Chevy chassis with a 454 V8 engine in it and then everything inside is true to 1975 so let's go take a look. In 1975 screen doors have changed they're no longer the wood ones but they've gone to aluminum uh, and of course Remember back in the 70s when they had that nice faux wood paneling? <laughs> They've got it here. That was really something special in those days. But let's go inside because you have got to take a look at this. Check out the blue floral upholstery. <laughs> Does that say 70s or what? This is a pretty spacious rig. It is a 20 six let me check no 25 foot rear bath model um you know and again without slides and things it's still pretty spacious i'm going to just check out the cockpit in here it is a uh front motor not like a diesel pusher so i do have this piece in it like any gas motor home even today but you know if the headroom's good it's kind of neat hey Big windows, lots of storage. There is um, a cam, uh, a screen here, but that was added after the fact for a rear view camera. Um, just when they were using it for promotional purposes, they needed that. But everything else is, you know, an original dashboard. And uh, yeah, kind of neat. Imagine switching gears, driving down the road. This uh, 25 foot actually has three different sleeping areas in it because this will make down into a bed and then the dinette will make down into a bed just like they normally do today as well and then coming back here is another big long bed so you could you could probably sleep six people in here so in this kitchen, um, you know, like me always, I have something to say about how much countertop space there is, not a ton, uh, but you do get two sinks, um, you get in your taps, there's pretty good storage here. <laughs> For uh, this vintage of a rig, you're still getting a uh, microwave oven. I don't remember if we even had one in our house at this time. So we've got a four burner stove. I love that. And do you guys remember these that you had to lift up to pull out? And that's how they stayed in place while you're driving down the road. You got three of those. So, I mean, plus your uppers. I remember these lights too. Do you guys remember those? where you had to, like there's no switches down low, you had to reach up and touch that to turn it on. This particular unit has a huge fridge. I mean, for its vintage again, this is a big fridge. Oh, there's the lock. That's a big fridge and a freezer. So they've got quite a bit of storage here with a closet and drawers. Then this is an accordion door to the bathroom. You guys must remember those too, right? 
so cool. But anyways, inside, this is a pretty big bathroom, toilet, sink, and a uh, kind of full tub and shower in there. So that kind of wraps up the original number one version of the Winnebago Itasca. Uh, yeah, this should be taking you all right back to the 70s. Don't forget to hit subscribe if you want to see some more. We have totally enjoyed ourselves here at Jack Sizemore RV Edition.